I wanted to meet someone here and I wanted to completely trick them. And I said, there are thousands of kids looking for answers from abuse and you like it? So you get off to that? I'm just having trouble understanding this. You understand that you're trying to justify pedophilia, right? How's it going YouTube? It's Crypto and WO here. Finding links on the deep and dark web. I was actually finding a chatting link because I wanted to deliberately find a predator on the deep web. And the chat with John Doe link that I use in nearly all of my videos, it wasn't working. So I was trying to find other links and I was testing out this website here, the Able Onion chat. Already with the first chat I interacted with, I already came across a predator. It starts from the bottom and it goes to the top. Asked me age straight off the bat. I said, I'm 13 years old. How about you? Male or female? They said 20 year old male. I said, I'm a female. So they currently think that I am a female and that I am of the age of 13 years old where I'm, I'm a 25 year old man at this point, but I said I'm a female. He said, are you new? I said, I got on last week. Immediately, they said, have you ever sucked? Oh, hey, hi, how's it going? Editor notes here. So I think this is the first video on YouTube that actually has multiple disclaimers. The dude that he talks to in this video is extremely creepy. So I don't care how old you are. I don't want you to talk to anybody that talks to you like this. I actually found three more predators that are doing the exact same thing. Trying to expose these predators that I meet on the dark web is gonna be a brand new series on this channel. So if you guys wanna see more of these videos, go ahead and subscribe to the channel for that. Don't try whatever I'm doing in this video. Some of these people are actually clever enough to steal your data and become an actual problem for you. But stick around till later on in the video if you guys want to see this person's IP address. I dropped it. And I also just wanted to clarify that there are no hidden messages within any of my videos. Yeah, th this is absolutely terrible. But I told them, no, I haven't. And I'm going to see where this is going to take me from here. I'm actually going to try getting this person off this chat. I'm going to see if I can video call this person eventually later on in this video. So try sticking on till later on in the video, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to try to video call this person on the deep and dark web and catch them completely off guard because they're on the dark web trying to remain anonymous, but they are also trying to do really, really dirty things. As far as they know, I am a 13 year old girl. And if I, even though I'm not, imagine they actually come in contact with an actual 13 year old girl on the dark web. This is where it gets really problematic. We don't want this to happen. So they said, what would you like to do, sweetie? I told them I'm just trying to find scary links. I love horror movie. And the reason why I'm doing this is because I actually requested this in one of my previous videos. Now I wanted to ask you guys, what do you think is the best punishment for these types of people? Do you think the police should have access to everyone's private data like IP addresses? Should I try to chat with one of these people on the dark web and see why are they even like this? So the random person said, what have you found so far? And I said, nothing, I can't find anything. I took ever finding this. I'm trying to double down on my grammar mistakes because I did say that I'm a 13 year old female and I'm not trying to come across as an intellectual right now, you know? I'm just trying to come across as innocent, ignorant, like whatever children, you know, they're, they don't have a fully developed brain yet so they don't really know what they're doing. Yeah, it's hard finding stuff on here. Did you watch the show about dark web or something? They're asking me if I saw the show on the dark web. I, I didn't know there was a show on the dark web to be honest, but I, there is a movie. I'm not gonna say that, but I'm gonna say I came across this on YouTube maybe like Jester's videos or something. I wanted to know what the dark web is. Before I asked them, what would you like to, what do you like to do on here? They said, I haven't seen anything scary. Maybe a few things that were violent. Oh, what the hell? This person's found violent content on the dark web. You can see who we're already dealing with. If they are 20 year old male, I don't know why they would say they're a 20 year old male. You're not supposed to do that. You know, you're supposed to follow the rules of the dark web. Don't say you're a 13 year old female either. I don't condone the behavior I'm doing right now because when you're talking to these people, you're actually talking to dangerous people. They, they like to watch violent. So please don't try what I'm doing right now. Oh, this is oh, this is bad. Oh, no, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know why that's the first thing that came to my mind. <laughs> Jake Paul is so hot. They said LOL. <laughs> I actually don't want to say too much jokes because like this person probably thinks they're getting punked at this point. Like they've been browsing on here for probably a couple of hours, talking and talking and talking to different people. And for them, they believe they striked gold right now. They, they found somebody that didn't skip on them, that talks English and that said that they're a 13 year old girl. Uh, are you in bed? Oh no. I'm so tried. I did that on purpose. What are you wearing? My pajamas. The problem with this is I feel like I'm feeding into their fantasy right now and I don't want to do that. I'm here to interview these people. This is what I wanted the original intention of the video to be. I wanted to meet someone here and I wanted to completely trick them. My goal is I'm going to say like, oh guys, I have a bunch of links on the dark web. So tell me what kind of links do you want? I wanted someone to tell me that they wanted links to that bad stuff. And before I was going to say anything, I was going to say, hey guys, before I send anything, can you answer a couple of questions for me? And that's where it was going to become an interview about why they're like this. 
However, this person right now, I feel like I'm feeding into this fantasy, so I have to I have to come I have to stop this immediately, you know? What color? Okay, I have a brown shirt and gray boxers. Do you have boobs yet? I'm, I'm gonna stop feeding into his fantasy, and now I'm gonna start asking him questions to see if he does this often, you know? I, I'm gonna put him in the corner, you'll see. A few moments later. Only on here. So I said, I'm 13 and you're 20. That's wrong. So it's just chatting. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is where the chat gets really freaking bad. I have a question. I'm gonna try to ask it. I'm just gonna ask it. He said, you can say anything you want freely. We will never know each other. But then they said, you can tell me things you can't tell others. Why do you like girls my age? My mom told me people like you are bad. You know, I'm, tr I'm trying to stay innocent here and I'm trying to get answers. I'm trying to interview these people. This is the whole point of the video, you know? I'm trying to interview these people to see why they're even like this. They said, do you like to look at other girls? There is a difference of liking and doing also. What do you mean? I just want to know so badly, girls look sexy. He said, I wonder if you look sexy. This is so bad, man. I said, at my age, every guy is different, so some are worse. Your mom thinks about the worst ones. I said, why though? Don't you like 20 year old? Ah, my God, this is terrible. I like 20 year old also. But I'm talking to you now. They said, I've sexted with 20 year here also. Do you have Discord? It's about to go down. The problem with men today, and this is an actual problem, is they don't know when a girl is flirting with them. They don't know when a girl is being kind to them. So they think like if they just get positive responses the entire time, they're like, oh my God, it's about to happen. It's about to happen. Oh, they said, well, yeah, but won't share it. Why? I said, I want to see what you sound like. W what if you're a thousand years old? Random said, I'm sure you would like my voice, but no, doesn't sound old. Have you had your first kiss yet? <laughs> He's like, this is what people think about nowadays. Random person said no. So I said, I have never been on a date with someone 20. They're gonna understand what I'm saying. You guys understand what I'm saying. Have you had 13? They said no. I said, why do you like me then? They said, you haven't done anything I didn't like. I want to show you my PJs. You could get Qtox. It's like Discord for this. They said Qtox is safer. I don't think you can even 13 on Discord. I said, listen, dude, I have a question. I'm actually 15. I'm not but and i'm doing a school project on pedophilia this is pretty private can you just answer questions for me will you not quote me they said 15 sounds sexier anyways bro what the hell i mean i'll have screenshots but it says your name is random i just need to support my assignment on why i think people are like this oh boy okay so so oh my god we got into the door can you please not do that I said it would help my mark, but okay, I won't. I just wanted to ask, when did this start? Did something happen to you or did you just like look at little girls and start to like them? They said, maybe you should do a different project. You are too young to even work on that. They said, nothing happened to me. I just like it. And I said, there are thousands of kids looking for answers from abuse and you like it? I said, what's to like about it if you don't mind me asking? They said, I don't like abuse, no. They said, I mean, do you watch porn? By the way, I just wanted to ask you guys if you guys like this little editor notes thing that I do in my videos, just let me know in the comment section. I love constructive criticism. I love all sorts of feedback. Back. So if you guys like this, just let me know in the comment section, please. Back to the video. I'm not allowed to, so I don't. Well, you know, I have to remember, I'm, I'm talking to them as a 13 or a 15 year old, so I'm not allowed to do that type of stuff. So I'm telling them like, no, I'm not allowed to, so I don't. You're not allowed to do this, so why are you doing it? Do you actually like Jake Paul? I said, no, I just want to know why you like the kids who like Jake Paul. <laughs> are you abusing him for liking to look at him? If he was under 18, then this is turning into a debate. <laughs> what is this? How is looking abuse? It's not, but engaging with it is just asking for more. The person said, so you don't look at other boys in school? What is this? What? If you've never even seen porn, you are too young to understand this. Now, do I have to hit him with a plot twist that I'm 25 years old to make this guy look stupid? What if I told you I'm 25? A few moments later. Are you even doing a paper? 
<laughs> I said, listen, dude, I came here to get answers. I came here to understand why people are like this. Everyone is different and what they do is different. I said, do you think what you do is wrong? Now, this is where we start speaking morals. You know, if he says no, they said no, because I'm not touching kids and people on here pretend to be young for fun. I said, so you get off to that? I'm just having trouble understanding this. You understand that you're trying to justify pedophilia, right? Sometimes, but I just go with what is happening. And it sounds like you don't want answers. You just want to judge. I said, now I'm starting to judge because you're trying to defend it. I was expecting more of a, yeah, I'm a piece of crap and sorry about that. You're not even sorry. You're just sick because you don't listen to me. I said, okay, dude, I'm going to give you some homework. Read this chat from bottom to top. Tell me that's not creepy and twisted. They said, so you're lying that you aren't judging. You judge as you listen and expect something. Knowing I'm 25, look at the chat again where you thought I was a 13 year old female. I'm interrupting him and he's interrupting me. This has become an actual debate. This looks like American politics. I'm Canadian and I know what your politics looks like, guys. Your age wasn't even important to me. I said, oh, shut up. You were gonna nut when I said a 13 year old female. I was just prying questions. You said you did it before. He said, I'm not even hard. That must suck. So you're just sick. You know where this is gonna end. If you think of every debate that's ever happened where no opinions have ever been changed, I don't think I'm gonna change his opinion. He's not, not gonna change my opinion. This is wrong, this is wrong. I'm not even gonna tolerate this. I actually just wanted to tell you guys that I ended up coming across more predators on the dark web. And when I found all those people, that is when I fully decided that I'm gonna turn this into a brand new series on the channel. So again, like I said earlier, subscribe to the channel if you guys wanna see these type of videos. And to be honest, that's all. If you made it this far into the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. If you wanna see more videos like this where I chat with a sick person on the deep and dark web and try to get actual answers next time. Let me know in the comment section down below. Until next time, I'll see you in the future. Stay off the dark web.